Hi, this is Dennis at Two Guys Custom Fishing Lures at www.twoguyscustomfishinglures.com. Today we're going to tie a saltwater quarter ounce shrimp head, jig head, and I'm going to take it to the device, tighten her up, take your thread, you're going to start back on a little bit of an angle and wrap it around over top of itself. You get a little tag there, cut the little tag off. And you wrap it a few more times there. Then you're going to take some bucktail. I'm using a chartreuse green color, very similar to the jig head itself. Take a piece, cut it off. Pull all the tiny little hairs out of there. Slide that up over. Take it and start wrapping it. and then you take some more bucktail until you get it to the thickness of what you want the bucktail to stick out the back of the jig head. Get more here. Pull a little hairs there. I don't know if you can see them on camera or not. And you take it and you start wrapping it again. Make sure it's completely all the way around on both sides so everything's covered. Twist it around a little bit and start wrapping. And I'll add a little bit more just to fluff it up a little more on the bottom here. This is all your discretion of how you want your jig heads to look if you're tying them up. Going, pull some of the excess little hairs out, get them up all down on there. And then you start tying it. You take it, you're gonna bring your two fingers like this and twist it a couple times, and down and around. This all. Get your nice little fluff out the back there. It's all twisted around. And you take some clear nail polish. Put a big glob on there. On both sides. Make sure it gets all the way around. And there's your jig head. And here's another one too. This is one I tied a little bit earlier. So that's what's to it. And you can add some flash to it. Make it a little bit shinier and stuff like that for the fish. These work pretty well for flounder, striper, um, weekies, different types of saltwater fish. Um, and you can also see these on our website at www.twoguyscustomfishingwars.com. Thank you.